No, all of you, 99% of you do not want to work for someone else. You do not want to do 9 to 5. You're only doing it because you haven't gotten to the point where you don't need to do it yet. Following me? So if this you're watching this, you're one of them. I'm not. I would this. I'm putting the best way I could put it. For you. I am not talking to anybody that doesn't get what I'm saying. There are some people out there that's great that they can do their nine to five. They love it. They don't care. They go to work and they just do the do the do, do the thing, right? You're not one of those people. You have bigger goals, bigger aspirations. That's why you're called a chosen one. That's why you're called light workers, enlightened. But here's the thing that you're you're doing that's stopping you from progressing to that next level. You have accepted that you are limited and you have accepted to live in fear. You have accepted to obey your physical mind. Stop doing it. Stop obeying your physical mind. It's just going to keep you in the rat race, in the matrix. Remember, the key word is chosen. When you are, when the universe chose you or choose you, it have to give you extra power or extra thing because it's called, you're going to have a lot of extra burden on you. Many of you don't even know that. Many of you don't even realize how powerful you are. Yes, it's going to be uncomfortable. To who, to who more power is given, more responsibility. That's just how it works. That's right. Stop obeying your physical mind. What do I mean by that? I literally mean that when you already know that you're built to do big things, you have this vision in your head and you want to create it. Your physical mind will tell you it can't be done. You don't have the connections. Stop obeying your physical mind. That's what I mean by it. Do not listen to it. It doesn't know anything. I'm telling you this. I'm telling you the truth. This is how it works. Tell your physical mind just like this. Relax. I got this under control. Tell your mind who you are, man. That's what you are. Okay, that's what you came here to do. So, if I'm lying, put it in the comments. Tell me you're another person that's watching this video that cannot do a nine to five, that cannot function with around structure, that cannot function with a whole bunch of people around you, that cannot be in a large sums of groups with people. You just don't function well with that. Tell me I'm lying if that's true, if I'm lying. Is anyone here can do the opposite of what I say? Can you function? perfectly in large sums of group can you function with structure can you function with a nine of five if you can go comment below the reason you cannot do that stuff is because number one also you have a more sensitivity to energy you pick up other people's energy really fast man so when you're in a group of your work setting you're gonna get anxious you're gonna feel nervous and you're gonna wonder why and then when and here's the biggest one you here's the biggest tip to show that you're a chosen one. I'm going to show you something. If this is happening to you, you know 100%. And I can guarantee you it's happening to 99% of you guys. Here's how it Whenever you go around with large groups of people, whether it be in your workplace, even if you go out into the public, into the mall, wherever there's a large sums of people, whenever you get away from those people, you feel tired and drained. And there's nothing wrong. You feel like you just did a five-hour workout. You feel fatigue, man. Tell me if I'm lying about that. You feel so tired. It feel like it feel, you always feel like you have like chronic fatigue syndrome. When, when only this all money happens when you go out in public with people. Again, this video will only find you that is resonating too. This is the message for you. It's not so any. There's no one on this video that will not resonate with this. If they watch it and they hear it, they'll flip it off because their mind isn't tuned to it. 
See, look at this. We have a solo said, I went inside a barbecue place yesterday and I got anxiety right away. So do you know why that's happening? You know why, why it's happening? Let me tell you why. Let me, let me give you this scientific approach and show you how this stuff works. You see, as I said, when you came here, you took extra energy with you because you know what you have to do here. So you have extra power, you have extra sensory input, you have extra sensitivity in your nerve, you have extra power in viewing and psychic stuff. All of that is crammed into your little brain when you came here. It's still there. So now, when you go out into the public, remember, we're always communicating. The easiest way to put it on it, your volume, let's use a radio. Everybody, everyone's uh, radio is turned to the lower and the middle level. Your volume is on blast. It's high. That's just how it's set when you get when you came here. It was set like that for a reason. Because you have so much to do, you have so much to create to manifest. You have extra you have extra sensory input than a normal person. So when you go out into the public, naturally you're gonna pick up over power of energy and emotions. And remember now, your body, okay, is still physical. So the body can only handle so much. So your cells are going to get a little bit depleted because you're soaking in all this extra thing that you, your DNA has already set it on high. And this is why you can't do nine to fives, man. This is why you like to be in small spaces with small groups of people. This is why most likely you like to be by yourself a lot. You like to be around a couple of people. This is why you like to do your own thing, make your own work, and do. And this is why this because this is exactly what's going to happen for you when you came. This this is why you're here to do that stuff. So now that you realize this stuff, all right, man. I know this for years. Okay, I've been doing it. So how do I how do I get what I want, man? Cause I've been doing this, and I everything you're saying, man, is true. But I still haven't made any progress. I'm gonna repeat it again. Okay, listen. For you, for you, the chosen people. Okay. I just said something very important in the beginning of this live, and I'm gonna say it again. What did I tell you? I said that when you came here, everything inside of you is extra power. Is that that's correct? What I said, right? Okay. All right. If everything inside of you has extra, put it like this, everything inside of you is like on steroid, so to speak. So you have regular energy, then you have like super power energy. That's the best way I can put it on it. You're, you're in this like, okay, I'm going to use a car. You're, you're on a supercharged turbo car versus a naturally aspirated four-cylinder car. You're a, you're a high-octane fuel car beast, okay? That's what you're. So everything on you is a performance-based thing. You're a high-performance being. Hypercar, whatever, supercar, okay? That's the analogy. So if everything is on that level, imagine if you do this, and I'm going to show you to do it. And many of you have probably been doing it but haven't been doing it uh, consistently. If you want to get out of this rat race for you, the ones watching this, here's what you do, people. If you visualize the stuff you want, it's going to manifest a lot faster than the normal population of people. Because you are on supercharge. Your visualizations are super higher and supercharged than all the regular people of visualization. So if you just take some time and when you go to bed and you close your eyes and you fall asleep and you see the image of what you want to do in the end results, <coughs> excuse me, from end thinking, just the end of it, and you do that consistently, it'll come to you so fast. But you're listening to your physical mind. When you're about to do it, your mind is telling you, hey, it's not gonna work, it's not. But I'm here to tell you, it has to, it's gonna work because that's who you are. So I'm not doing this video, this is not a video for you to think like, oh, to stroke the ego, to make you feel big or not. It's just not a video about that. It's the video about the truth of who you are. So you don't get in the trap of your ego saying, oh man, so we're this really powerful being, man. Da, 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 da. No, it's going to trick you. Just know who you are. Humbly accept it. And then start to go into your purpose and your dream and your vision. That's all you have to do. Okay, because you are... You already know that you're powerful. You know it already. You, you, there's, there's stuff happening to you that doesn't happen there. I mean, there's so much stuff happening for you 
that you can't even tell your own closest friends or you tell your family because they'll think that you're trippy or weird. There's things that you're seeing, you're seeing visions, you're seeing things, you're feeling things, you're getting voices telling you something about that person and you can't even go and tell them. Because you're saying to yourself, man, something's wrong with me. Am I weird? There's nothing wrong with you. You're not weird. You're a chosen one, an enlightened light worker. That's what you are. So this is the message that I was told to deliver to you today so that you can get on it and get into your passion and your purpose. So if you're here, you might as well go do it. Like you say, my friend, how to win the lottery says it. You are the CEO, the director, and the creator of your life. Start to live it and start to do it. All right. See you again next time.